For the Rural Radio Network, I'm Tyler Cavalli. On Tuesday in Lexington, the 2014 Manure Demonstration Day was held at the Dawson County Fairgrounds. Manure Demonstration Day is a smaller version of the North American Manure Expo. It focused on the needs of the manure industry in Nebraska. Participants viewed vendors, demonstrations, and had opportunities to learn more about manure management and handling. One of the key speakers for Manure Management Day was Greg Eibach, director of the Nebraska Department of Agriculture. Greg and I sat down together for an interview as we discussed his speech and Manure Management Day. I'm here with Greg Eibach. He is the director of the Nebraska Department of Agriculture. And Greg, this is a big day for Nebraska, and this is the second time that Nebraska has kind of had an event like this. Last time was had the National uh, Manure Day, and that was up in Norfolk in 2011. And now it's kind of a, a smaller scale, generalized just towards Nebraska. And Greg, uh, talk about that. Why is this is important for Nebraska and for farmers and ranchers? Well, I think this is an important topic because we're a large livestock state. Uh, those livestock uh, produce nutrients that uh, we need to use responsibly. And uh, this uh, field day gives uh, farmers, ranchers, and livestock growers the opportunity to come and see the, the equipment that is uh, available to spread those nutrients, uh, the technology that's available to make sure that we target those nutrients in the right areas of our fields and in the right concentrations and it's just a, a great opportunity to see all of this in one at one time all together and actually watch some demonstrations take place as well okay greg you gave a speech earlier today and talk about that speech well i you know when we're uh, looking at nebraska is we're already a great livestock state but i think there's a lot of potential for us to even grow our livestock numbers and become an even more important livestock state the world wants protein and uh, we have the ability to produce that here in Nebraska. We have the, the natural resources in our grass and water. We have the uh, crops, the soybeans and the alfalfa and the corn that livestock need to, uh, to become uh, meat for our table. And so I think we put those together with the skills and abilities and uh, background of our producers that already are friendly uh, and good agriculture and livestock producers. We just have a, a recipe for success. Okay. Well, what is this day in your speech? How can those two intertwine? Well, I guess, uh, you know, I made a comment at the beginning of the speech that, uh, you know, we're learning how to, uh, to uh, handle uh, the nutrients that are produced and now we need to talk about producing more of those nutrients. And okay. So, uh, you know, livestock uh, gives us a great opportunity to build our communities, bring sons and daughters back to the farm, and uh, create jobs in rural Nebraska and, and, and build on our strengths. By the end of the day, uh, when everyone leaves, what was your guys' plan? I know you just gave a speech, but your guys' overall intention, um, everyone learning by the time they left today. Well, I think that, uh, you know, we want to give producers the tools and knowledge to enhance their ability to be uh, environmental stewards while they're utilizing the nutrients that livestock produces uh, in their cropping uh, activities. And then we also want to open their minds to thinking about growing that livestock industry in Nebraska as well. Participants viewed two demonstrations, a liquid manure demonstration and a solid manure demonstration along with many educational sessions. For the Rural Radio Network, I'm Tyler Cavallo.